Hi, my name is Phil Scarito with Deviate Fitness. Two things I'm going to show you today that are actually really pissing me off that I've been seeing with a lot of clients. Um, very simple. The swing, which we all know is a foundational exercise. How many times do you see clients pick up the bell like this and start swinging the bell? Okay. Every time a client of mine does that, they do 10 squat thrusts. I'm tired of it. You can't generate any power doing that. Okay, so what I tell my clients to do is to step back, keep the bell out in front of you a couple feet. Okay, when you approach the bell for a swing, don't just drop into it like this and grab the bell. Okay, I want you to act as if you're gonna lift, you're gonna do a deadlift. So I want you to pull yourself back, grab the bell, inhale through your nose and then pull up, hike the bell back like you mean it. Don't pick up the bell and start swinging. It's very ineffective. Number two, take your arm, bring it overhead, okay? If you can't lock out your arm like this, if you have a slight bend in your arm with no weight at all, then you shouldn't be doing anything overhead. That's snatches, presses, jerks, clean and jerks, whatever. If you can't do this and lock out your arm here, then you shouldn't be doing any overhead work. You should seek a CKFMS specialist first and try to do some Z Health mobility drills to work on locking out your elbow, okay? So, the swing, keep the bell ahead of you, hike the bell back, don't pick it up. Take your, do this test, do it in front of a mirror. Bring your arm up overhead. If you can't lock it out, then don't do any overhead work because this, lock out, is not an RKC approved lockout. This is RKC approved lockout. Phil Scarito, DVA Fitness.